And we, our campus, our main campus is located on the European side, right by the sea. That thing, the, the, the um, building that you are seeing here is our campus. And in this campus, we are offering engineering and natural sciences, economics and social sciences, educational sciences and law faculties. They are all located in the main campus here. And every department that you are seeing here, we are offering education in English. So as I said, we are an international university, an internationally recognized university. So that's why the medium of instruction for every program that we are offering is in English, except for law, because it's the Turkish law, it's not the international law. So that's why it's in Turkish, like 80% in Turkish. But the rest of the programs that you are seeing is in English. So the programs that we have under engineering faculty is the most popular ones are artificial intelligence, software and computer engineering currently, because these are the demand on these years, thanks to AI and ChatGPT and all the developments in the world. But we do also have molecular biology and genetics, management engineering, energy systems engineering, and biomedical engineering. And Dana here is studying biomedical engineering, so maybe she can talk more about the department. If there is anybody interested in biomedical engineering, uh, we'll know more about the department. So stage is yours, Dana. Okay, yeah. So basically, I decided on biomedical engineering. Uh, because I wanted to study something related to health because I've always had this passion on like trying to uh, understand the human body, try to understand how it works. But I also wanted to do like an innovation and engineering side of it. So like for me, biomedical engineering was the perfect merge and fusion between them. So that's why I chose biomedical engineering. And how I found it was because uh, I was literally searching biomedical engineering in Europe. I didn't even search Turkey specifically, and Batu Shahid University popped up. So I basically just started uh, looking on the curriculum, on the courses, and I really liked it. And most importantly, that it was in English because I, I'm not gonna learn Turkish in like uh, six months that I was applying. So uh, that was basically how I found biomedical engineering. And when I started, I was very scared, not gonna lie, because uh, me, I started, I studied in Spanish fully. So I doing the merge to English, sorry, the, the change to English was a bit challenging, but it's handable. So uh, then the first year was a bit hard trying to adapt to the professors. You know, the lecturers are not the same in the university as in high school. So you have to adapt to the rhythm, to the strictness and everything. Uh, but it was it was handable. It, it's not impossible. We all can make it. And I loved biomedical engineering throughout the years, basically, because we all have uh, all the engineering have a laboratory dedicated to them. So biomedical engineering has two labs. One is biomechanics and one is biomedical engineering. So there we can see all of the uh, devices that we use for monitoring patients, for studying the patient condition, etc. Uh, and now I'm just basically working on some project proposals for uh, the research uh, institute here in Turkey. So it's it's very nice. You can find the engineering side, you can find the biological side of biomedical engineering, and you can choose at the end of the day what you want to spend your life doing, basically. So that's been my experience. <laughs> 